an international team of astronomers has just announced the discovery of the two earliest and most distant galaxies ever seen, dating back to only 300 million years after the Big Bang. These groundbreaking results, using NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, mark a major milestone in the study of the early universe. In this video, we'll dive into Webb's Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey, JADES, explore the characteristics and significance of these galaxies, and discuss the broader implications for our understanding of the cosmos. So without further ado, let's get started. The James Webb Space Telescope, through the Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey, JADES, has made groundbreaking observations, identifying the two most distant galaxies known to date. This survey is a collaborative effort involving top scientists from around the world, aiming to explore the early universe with unprecedented clarity. JADES has a specific goal, to peer back into the first billion years of cosmic history and understand how galaxies formed and evolved during that critical time. The combination of Webb's advanced instruments and the meticulous planning of the JADES team has resulted in extraordinary discoveries. The newly discovered galaxies, the first one named JADES GSZ-14-0 and the second one named JADES GSZ-14-1, are not just distant but also astonishingly old. They date back to approximately 300 million years after the Big Bang. To put this into perspective, if the universe's history were a 24-hour day, these galaxies appeared just about two minutes after midnight. This discovery is monumental because it gives us a glimpse into the universe's infancy. The first galaxy, which is the more distant and significant of the two, stands out due to its impressive size and brightness. This large galaxy is filled with young stars, suggesting that it formed quickly and effectively early in the universe's history. The abundance of young, massive stars within it highlights an exceptionally efficient process of star formation. The second galaxy, while slightly less distant, still holds the record for being one of the earliest galaxies observed. The ultraviolet light from both galaxies has been stretched to infrared wavelengths by the expanding universe, making them visible only with Webb's advanced capabilities. Webb's infrared capabilities are crucial due to the extreme redshifts observed in galaxies like these two galaxies. Redshift occurs when light from a galaxy is stretched to longer wavelengths as the galaxy moves away from us, shifting towards the red end of the spectrum. This phenomenon is similar to the Doppler effect with sound, where the pitch of an ambulance siren drops as it moves away, but with light. Edwin Hubble's observations in 1929, encapsulated by Hubble's law, revealed that galaxies are receding from us at speeds proportional to their distance. This was the first evidence that the universe was expanding. By measuring the redshift of galaxies, astronomers can determine how far back in time they are looking, essentially peering into the universe's infancy. The discovery of these two extremely redshifted galaxies, dating back to just 300 million years after the Big Bang, challenges the conventional timeline of cosmic evolution. These findings indicate that galaxies can form significantly faster than previously believed, suggesting that the mechanisms for galaxy creation were already in place early in the universe's history. This calls for a re-evaluation of the traditional models of galaxy formation, which assumed that massive galaxies took billions of years to develop. Scientists now must explore new theories that account for such rapid and prolific star formation, considering factors like higher matter densities, intense radiation fields, and unique chemical compositions in the early universe. The intricate data derived from the extreme redshifts of these two galaxies challenges the conventional timeline of galaxy formation and provides a critical bridge for rethinking cosmological models. The established estimate of the universe being 13.8 billion years old, based on cosmic microwave background, CMB observations and Hubble's law, is now being questioned. Recent theories, like those proposed by Rajendra Gupta, suggest a much older universe, potentially around 26.7 billion years, which prompts a significant re-evaluation of cosmological assumptions. Gupta's theory, incorporating the tired light hypothesis, 
suggests that photons gradually lose energy over cosmic distances, contributing to redshift. This theory, coupled with introducing new physical constants that evolve over time, proposes a much older universe, accommodating the existence of early galaxies. While the mature galaxies observed by Webb support the idea of rapid galaxy formation, the scientific community remains cautious about Gupta's radical theory. Experts like Dr. Luke Barnes and Professor Tamara Davis emphasize the need for extraordinary evidence to support such extraordinary claims. They argue that while Webb's observations are puzzling, they do not necessarily imply a much older universe. Scientific skepticism is essential in this context. Gupta's theory needs to be tested against a broad range of cosmological data, not just supernova data, to gain acceptance. Despite the challenges posed by these new findings, efforts are underway to reconcile them with existing models. Researchers are exploring potential refinements to our understanding of early galaxy formation processes and the rate of cosmic expansion. These efforts aim to integrate the new data without fully adopting radical theories that lack sufficient evidence. In conclusion, the recent discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope have opened up new frontiers in our understanding of the universe. The identification of the earliest and most distant galaxies challenges our current theories of galaxy formation and the age of the universe. These findings highlight the importance of advanced observational tools and the need for continuous exploration and technological advancements in astronomy. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exciting updates on our universe's latest discoveries. See you next time.